Hello YouTube, um, just following on from my little video earlier because I'm going to move the two boxes behind me into a different location soon so I won't be able to actually physically pull the cables in the way that I want to to show you. Uh, I've now actually got them up and they are mirroring each other, the two boxes. I did manage to team the two extra gigabit NICs um, so now they're teamed between the two boxes, the two Ethernet, uh, the additional Ethernet NICs, and they're using this uh, teamed interface on the free BSD. We'll have a look at that another time. Now I'll just show you it working. Right, let's get a good screenshot going on here. Just have to move it and see we can't get further out. Now I'm hoping that this is going to be good enough. So let's just zoom that one and we'll just get one of the discs on its own. Right, so as you can see the role is showing as primary and this one is showing as secondary um, if I do I've called me a Z pool tank for some reason because everybody seems to do this um, so we'll say Z pool status tank and we're gonna get an error cannot open tank no such pool because now we're on the secondary come on get zoom in for me right now if I do the same one here can see that it's showing there no errors on it and if I do the hast CTL status you'll see that the primary there is showing as full sync and complete so now that's file at zero 01 I'm now gonna pull the network cable ah, what we'll do in the meantime is I'm going to just pull up the CARP interface and I'm just going to ping that 192.168.1.15 T so there's our CARP interface listening on 1.15 and I'm going to physically pull the network cable on that now file 01 there is the cable in my hand there's the timeout and there's it being picked up by filer 2 cable back in we'll get rid of that and now if I do a status you can see that the disk is now secondary and it's showing as full sync complete. If I now move across to our other screen here, HACTL role is primary, it's complete, full sync and complete. And now if I do a Z pool status again, you can see that it's moved across and no known errors. And that's status complete. What I'll now do is I will pull the network cable on number two. There's the cable and on the other screen we should see it drop out. Which we have and it's picked back up on there. And now I'll put it back in. And let's have a look now. That should have gone over. 
the Z pull should no longer exist there. And we should now be shown a secondary and in sync. Full sync complete, no dirty. And now back to the first one. Z pull status is cool, no known errors. And that status is showing as primary, full sync and complete with no dirty. All looking good. Right, until next time. Now we'll put some uh, ice scuzzy on it and then we'll get it connected to the VMware boxes. I'll just move them into the other room now, being as everything's working fine. See you soon.